News 19 is partnering with Make-A-Wish Alabama for our Wake Up for Wishes telethon coming up later this month. And nearly 100 children in our viewing area alone are waiting for the organization to grant their wishes. Everything from trips to gifts to experiences. No wish is too big, but a wish can only be granted through donations made right here in Alabama. That's why News 19 wants to help. In the weeks leading up to the telethon, we're introducing you to some of the kids waiting for their wishes to be granted. So you can see the impact your donation has on those kids right here in our own backyard. This is Tegan's story. Whoa, whether it's walking the dog or feeding the animals. Just peck and peck. Tegan loves getting outdoors. Boy Scouts and hiking. But he has his eye on a different setting in the future. The beach. More specifically, the breakers in Palm Beach. I really like seafood and I also like how they're right next to a beach. Tegan is asking Make-A-Wish to bring his family to the breakers to celebrate being cancer free. I was honored that he would want to do that, you know. I know he'd, he'd been through a whole lot. Dad Chris says it was a long road to get here, and Tegan has the scars to prove it. This one is where my first surgery was. It got most of the tumor out. He needed two brain surgeries. They saw just a little bit that was still left there that they had to take out. Followed by four rounds of chemo to rid the now 12-year-old of a cancerous tumor. It's called medulloblastoma. It blocks the fluid from draining out of the brain, and that causes your brain to kind of swell up, become inflamed, have high pressure. Specialists found the cancer in 2022 after Tegan started suffering from migraines and nausea. I was thinking, like, am I going to die? Am I going to be disabled for the rest of my life? But after the surgeries, radiation, and therapies, doctors delivered the good news. I felt amazing. I just defeated brain cancer. It's been wonderful to be able to see him, kind of to see that he does have a chance of having a normal life again. I love this animal. There's still some work to be done to get Tegan back to 100%. I just got some problems with like balance. And having a trip on the books, is certainly something to look forward to. You know, we haven't really gotten to go to the beach in quite a while because, you know, this this has taken uh, a lot of time. It'll be wonderful to get out there and not worry about things for a little while and just enjoy the moment. And for Tegan, the excitement is as much about the ocean as it is the chance to eat some seafood. It is my favorite food ever. Mine too, Tegan. If you're interested in helping children like Tegan make their dreams come true, you can donate to News 19's Wake Up For Wishes telethon. It's coming up on June 27th. If you can help us get a head start, though, you can donate right now. Text the word WISHES to 243-725, or you can scan this QR code on your screen right now. It's that little black and white box there in the corner. If you pull up your camera and hover it over the screen there, you'll see a link pop up. When you click it, it takes you to the Wake Up For Wishes fundraiser site. 96 children in North Alabama alone are waiting and every dollar you choose to donate goes towards granting their wishes.